Cowabunga dude bro Michelangelo. <laughs> Cowabunga dude bro Michelangelo? Yeah. How's it going everybody? Uh, Armando and Nicholas here for another unboxing from the new line of Playmates basic action figure toys from the Nickelodeon Rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles TV series. Who are we opening today, Nicholas? April Neal and her cat! April Neal and her cat? Yeah. Yeah, so let's see. We've got the new April Neal, and she has her new pet, Mayhem. She is a human, and her weapon is a baseball bat, which seems to be of the mystical variety. I want to open her up. You want to open her up? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, like... Um, she has the same basic artwork as all the non-turtles in this line, so if you have a, a Ninja Turtle, they're going to have a big artwork of just that character. And anybody else, including villains and good guys like Master Splinter and April, are going to have this little group shot of the turtles. So let's open her up, Nicholas. Yeah! So April is their street smart best friend, according to the packaging. So, show the camera. So this is Mayhem, this is her pet, it's sort of a, I don't even know what these are yet, but it's some sort of animal, it looks like a cat, but there's a lot more going on that we don't know yet. So she comes with a green baseball bat, as well as another green baseball bat, which is supposed to be the same one, it has this glowing mystical mystical substance coming out, so she's like swinging it and has a mystical power coming out. So these are the three accessories that come with April. And then, if we take her out of the package... I also did! Whoa! Alright, let me check her articulation, okay? So here's the new April O'Neil. She normally wears glasses in this show. I don't know why they didn't sculpt it over her face. They decided to sculpt it over her head like they were sunglasses. That's my biggest complaint so far. Let's check her articulation. She has a... Oh, she has actually a ball joint on her head. You want to put that there? Yeah, the same people. Okay, let's see. Another one. She has two, jo two points of articulation at her shoulder and two points of articulation at her elbow which is pretty much like the turtle except there's not an extra swivel on her wrist like the turtle so missing one point there but still a lot in her arm no waist articulation her her thighs have swivel and up and down so two points there her knees same thing I and that's it. So she probably, this is probably the most articulated April O'Neil action figure we've ever seen, ever, I think. How does she look, Nicholas? Good! Good? Yeah? Let's put her weapon. So, we um, need to okay, so on this regular bat, uh, down by the handle, it's really, it's really thick, so it's, and her hands are kind of small, so like, she holds it, but barely. I feel like that's not gonna, after a little bit of play, this won't stick around. But the, uh, it looks like it's a little thinner on the translucent fat, so let's look at that. So yeah, this is made of a different material. This, this uh, is a... I'm a hole. This, the, uh, the regular bat's more of a bendable, squishy, uh. plastic. This one's more firm. Uh, actually... Put, put, put it up there. But the translucent one comes out a lot quicker. I feel like this is kind of like a little bit rubbery. Damn. It stands on it pretty well. So, you want to play with them? I want to put these up there. Okay, we'll put them up there. Alright, well, thanks for watching everybody. We are almost done with this first wave of turtle nice. action figures. So, uh, thanks for watching along. Peace, Kalabunga, and Booyah Kasha! Bye-bye. Go back to the as well. <laughs> Bye, guys.